All right, Amanda, it's Friday, so you know what that means. We're in our Southern Union State Community College kitchen, joined by two chefs and Brian from B.B. King's Blues Club. Thanks so much for joining us again here on Alabama Live. Absolutely. You have, you have a nice little spread here. We do. Well, our chefs are going to uh, display one of our most popular uh, entrees this evening, um, and it's perfect timing as we kick off Restaurant Week, so we're so, participating. So what are, what are we making? Chef, tell us a little bit about the... Uh, we have a blackened chicken alfredo pasta. It, uh, it has garlic, tomatoes, onions, sauteed down in a cream sauce, sliced chicken and Parmesan cheese. Is this something folks order a lot? Uh, yes, ma'am. <laughs> that's, like, that's like the best dish we have. Okay, so y'all got a spread over here. Talk about the spread over here. Uh, well, we just got all the ingredients I just named. We're gonna mix those together to make a sauce for the pasta. Okay. What got some garlic, got some tomatoes, diced onions, some Parmesan. Um, my Alfredo sauce, we got a little black in the seasoning, Cajun seasoning, and parsley. So step one is the chicken, is yes, what I hear. You gotta, you gotta get the chicken perfect. You gotta get the chicken right. So if the chicken ain't right, the pasta ain't right. Okay, so what, what are we doing with the chicken? All right, so with the chicken, we're just gonna take a little six ounce. There's a lot of seasoning on that chicken. Oh, yeah, yeah. it's gotta be marinated. That's that deliciousness, <laughs> like, you know, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we're just gonna. Gonna coat that pan. How long do you let the chicken marinate in that seasoning? Uh, this is we we marinate this for at least 24 hours. Okay. I'm gonna get the two of them. So, yeah, nice now is cool. this typically for one or two people? Uh, this is this is one dish. Okay. I'm just doing two pieces. Of the, I can just show y'all exactly what we got going on. Now Let's what is that? Let's bring this with blackening season. Hence the blackened chicken pasta. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're going to probably saute it down for maybe three or four minutes on both sides so it's nice and firm. Okay. And then we'll uh, slice that up and put it on top of the pasta when we get ready. Now, Chef Tim, Chef Duke, how long have y'all been cooking? Uh, since I was this Ooh, big. Uh, we, we load on that. Uh, officially, I've been cooking since I was like 16. Okay. In the kitchen. What are some of y'all's favorite dishes to cook? Oh, me? I'm a soul food guy. Can't go wrong with fried chicken. Okay. <laughs> I, I like to be on the grill. Okay. I like to smoke meats. So kind of what you're doing right now. Yes, ma'am. So how long again does this go for? Uh, probably three or four minutes on both sides. Okay. Now you said this is one of the popular items on the menu. What else do people like to order? Most definitely. Um, of course, with our namesake, B.B. King's uh, famous lip smack and ribs. Mm. Okay. Um, is a huge thing. They, they're they both being modest about that, but they okay. most definitely can tear down on some ribs. Uh, we do have a, a, a nice new smoker where we smoke our meats. Um, and we also do a, a lot of catering. Um, and so uh, we're, we're really about to Everyone's about to see a lot more about that. Um, get it to bring it to your house and to your special event. Okay. So you're, you're seasoning the other side now. Yes, ma'am. So what does catering look like? Do people typically do barbecue with that too? Yeah, barbecue uh, with whole chicken. And that's one of the things we're featuring for our restaurant week is our, our combination of the ribs and the, and the half chicken. And so um, we do that. We actually get a request for this pasta a whole lot uh, okay. when we do catering and offsite events. Okay, so how many times do you think you're gonna flip this before it gets uh, that nice color? I'm gonna flip this probably one more time and then we'll be ready to pull those. Okay, and then the next part will be the sauce? We're gonna make that famous sauce. Okay, so people order the pasta a lot. You said barbecue. Yes. I like to round my meal off with dessert. What's what's the go-to dessert that folks? Oh, uh, my favorite is the white chocolate bread pudding. Bread pudding. Ooh, <laughs> okay. You were gonna say that too? I must have. Yes, yes. An absolute favorite, yeah. We also feature uh, live music Thursday through Sunday, which is always great. Um, good time, uh, five to, uh, six to nine on Sun Thursday and Sunday, and then eight to 12 on um, Friday and Saturday. Has some great local artists that we feature each month. So follow and find out what our calendar is. Perfect time in two for restaurant week. You're getting ready to yes. flip again? I am. Okay, I am. We're, we're doing the flip again. You don't see that golden color on yeah. there? Yeah. So when you when you say blackened chicken, what's how do you know it's blackened and not just burnt chicken? <laughs> <laughs> well, for one, the blackened is, is really in the seasoning. And it, it, you'll see, it, it's what gives it that golden color when you're okay. you frying it up. Now, now, if it's blackened, then you might want to start over. Okay. <laughs> All right, we're still cooking here. We're gonna check back in with y'all a little bit later and we're gonna make the sauce. Yes, and then as always, we're gonna put it all together and yes, try right. it out. That's the favorite part. The yeah. best part. Yes. <laughs>